Anna! I'm here. I hear you. Nice gun. You made it. I was worried sick while you were running around in that terminal. Yermak said you brought the sleeper carriage. You are simply the best. Sorry I'm talking so much, but I missed you. Okay, okay, back to business. <clears throat> Damned cough. I guess I spent too much time in that dump. Oh no. So, they have more guards than we anticipated. It seems risky, but Crest, Crest says, says such, such caravans are, are usually commanded by a captain. captain. So if we capture him, the others will surrender. Don't have a red dead thing with they that cough. They have about 15 guards. Four at the tugboat ladder, sentries at the pier. Sam will take the right flank. Come in, Sam. I'm in position. I can see a guard. Duke is to the left of the hangar. Come in. Duke in position, ready to take the guard off. Idiot is on the far crane. Ready for action. Got a mark on everyone on the pier. Crest has scouted out the basement. There's only two of them here. Busy repairing something, so... This seems to be the best part for point entry. Well, Artyom, we are all set. You managed to get out of the church quietly, so let's make this one the same. Yeah. It's no fun beating up immature soldiers like them. Cut the chatter. All right, Artyom, you're in charge. You call the shots. Okay, well, it's high time we started. So try to get on that tugboat. We'll give you cover. Let's go over the plan one more time. Once the tugboat is in our hands, Sam, Idiot, and I will go back to the Aurora, while Artyom, Duke, and Crest take the boat to the bridge. Good luck, everyone. One second, there's a hole on the top of this carriage. Stay in the shadow. Please. I am the shadow. <laughs> Now, how quietly do we want to do this? Green is friendly. Gosh, really? Problem is doing it so stealthy. Don't really give you an opportunity to uh, scope things out and try to find materials and weapons. And in the basement. So the the whole objective is just to get to. The tugboat, correct? Wait a second, I've been in here. here and wait for them to pass. Hey, what 
the scent. We have to check it out. Uh, what's the point? Do you have to look for more stuff to do? Well, I sure don't like it, but we gotta check. All right, let's do that. I'll avenge you if you get eaten. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. Just don't shoot my ass, though, okay, you avenging angel? What's the general idea? Don't shine your flashlight on me. Attention, on your right. Turn back about 20 clicks from there. Fuck those assholes. You're talking about the outpost? Yeah, the last time we were there, those fucking so-called vigilant watchmen made a sieve out of our bridge. Conveniently, everything was all right while we were unloading the wires. There are narrow spaces between the cargo. Squeeze out? through them. Damn assholes. <laughs> Who goes there? What's the use of just standing around? As if anyone is going to die. But you take us. You're making someone else rich. Okay, so there's nothing in here. I think there's someone on top of me. Let me see. Yep. Oh, <laughs> shit's so tense. <laughs> Fuck. Come on, come on, come on. So how long are we going to keep sitting on our thumbs here? Well, the Almost there. The generator shuts off all the time. If that's because you should have picked up normal spark plugs, not the shit you got. Oh my god. Sure would have saved us a lot shit. of trouble. Hey, who's shit, that? shit, shit, shit. So okay, you. And I met one or two more clips from you guys. So... That, anyway, what's your problem? Oh, you in a hurry? No, but I... This place gives me the creeps. That monster in the river? This shit is too much! <laughs> it's a shame you aren't in Chiboxery. What is that? Oh, one of those monsters sunk a barge. Now that's bullshit. Tell that to Sergei when you see him. He and the boys wanted to catch it. How? Well, the usual way. Got the boat anchor, put a roasted dog on it, tied the rope to a bullet, and then they waited. So, what happened? But it bit, that's what. And it bit so well, it pulled the bullet off the bar, yeah. along with half of its side. Mm. Well, so it's so well, 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 well. Wow! Like, wow! Almost there. Quietly. What happened next? Quiet. I got it! First try! No restarts. Oh shit. You damn fucker! Are you fucking kidding me? Bastard. Oh my god, I almost made it to the end without a restart. I was celebrating too. Then this guy just straight out, comes out of this door right here. Headlamps. Oh, shit. 
Really, dude? Are you gonna cross? Turn around, thank you. I was so close to having perfect stealth. I'm in, baby. Captain, my captain. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I can pay the, the goods. Take them. You can take the goods. Stay calm. It's us. We don't need your goods. Your tugboat, on the other hand. You can collect it at the bridge if you play your cards right. You got me? Uh, yes, of course. Order your people to stand down and nobody gets hurt. At once! Hey, hey listen, listen up, people! people. This, this is, is your skipper. skipper. Stand, Stand down, down and surrender at once. You did the right thing. It's nice to talk to a smart guy for a change. Now go! <laughs> Great job, Artyom. Artyom, all of our guys are fine. You did great. Wonder if people could die. If you fuck it up too badly. Yeah. Too late if you're not, we have no time to waste. Good luck, guys. I hope the winds are fair and the waters are smooth. And Artyom, watch it out there. Oh yeah, we're gonna need that luck, all right. Fair winds. Hurra! Man your stations, way anchor! We're gonna go about halfway there, then wait in the reeds until about 4 o'clock. We want to get there early in the morning, when the fog is the thickest and they are sleepy after the morning prayer. Artyomich, Duke, you're on final approach. There. See that fire at the very top? That's the control post. What well, used to be anyway. Now it's a shrine, believe. Closer to God at the top, you see. That's where you have to go. I'll distract the guards now. We have to get all the way to the top there. My gird. My gird. Hey, you are sure? Catch the line. Ready. Hey, sailor. What did you do to your barge? What you gonna sell now? <laughs> Whoa, you're so funny. GKS, please. So, Artyom, shall we move? Whoever gets there first wins. Break a leg. Dude, it's not a race. You can win, I don't care. Artyom, the Aurora is quietly moving into position. We'll be ready to act on your six. Roger that, sir. We're on it. Over. We'll deal with those crazy guys again. Tell me what he said. Well, let's see what's going on over there. Oh, so far so good.
My God. Be okay. This time means back. Back. But you kneel down to eradicate all the demons. You want to come back and die. Well, ask anyone. They got captured by heathens, but a heretic. Pseudo chop. Simon just got cold feet, that's all. All the stories people tell not to go. No, he did not. He came back. Huge bus at a church. He got his way to other way. Then he just made the sign of the cross. Move quick. I guess they wouldn't have weapons, would they? Sitting duck right now. We gotta move fast. But our cloister survived. For the faithful reside. And the Lord in his mercy and wisdom. Oh. Chosen one among them who goes by the name of Silantia. <laughs> and so speaketh the Lord. I will be with you and will keep you safe, provided you are true in your people. I didn't mean to kill that guy, but whatever. Do you reject Satan's deception? That thing they call the electric curse. The curse is this the enemy gave to the fools so that they would fancy themselves above reproach. So loud. God and more powerful than him. Reject Satan. Gotta go upstairs. Oh my god. It's so loud. This guy's using electricity as a headlamp. Oh no, it's not. It's a fire lamp. <laughs> Come on, dude, you gotta move. Turn around, please. There you go. Trying so desperately not to kill any of you, but one guy did fall overboard. I couldn't help it. I'm pretty sure I can just walk because it's, the rain's so freaking loud, it would muffle my footsteps. Hey. 
Whatever, dude. Not time. I'm in. So you got me, you damn terrorists. You took Katya, and now you have me. Damn, you are quicker too. Look, we're just passing through. Let us do peacefully. Our guys won't shoot. We've been easy on you people the whole time, and Katya asked us to take her along herself. Do you get me? Sure thing. First, you kill off the local cutthroats, and then you switch to us. Will you kill elders and children too? Or have you drunk enough blood already? Leave us for good now. God may punish you for your sins, but my responsibility is to tend my flock. That's a good boy. Hear me, brothers. Hold your fire. You hear me? I'll excommunicate everyone who shoots! Well, I did all I could. Just don't shoot. And tell the driver to keep it slow. The bridge is in shambles, so don't stop. Or the bridge might collapse. You will have to do you here. We've reached an agreement. They will let us through if we don't shoot and move forward. Don't stop. I repeat, do not stop. Over. Artyom, let's jump! Well, that's a job well done, huh? <laughs> if I was a little bit more patient, I definitely could have got through that without killing those two guys. Or three guys at the end there. Oh well. Spring! We left Volga behind. The endless expanses of Russia stretch before us now. The bridge dwellers had finally decided to believe that we were not demons and let us pass. Anna was right. We invaded their world, and it's not up to us to destroy it, no matter how stupid it may seem. Electricity is a sin. Is that really worse than the lies we were told in the Metro about how the whole world was dead and there was nowhere to go? Everybody in the tunnels bought that convenient lie. Once we reach Yamantau, we will at least know if that lie was justified. Since so far, we haven't met any signs of enemy occupation. Artyom. Artyom. Wake up, dear. Is he up yet? Artyom, the Colonel wants you on the breach. See you later. Come on, wake up. Dang, it's so inviting that bed though. What's with this chair? I can't get up. I can't- I literally can't- I stuck. You did a great job there. We are not home anymore. So we'd all better act like you did. Uncle Artyom, Uncle Docker has already set his shop up. Wanna go look? It's so cool. Here, Uncle Artyom. 
Ah, hi, Artyom. See my new place? Fit for a king, I must say. Well, what do you think of this workbench, eh? Everything is within reach, yet there's so much space left. Most of the stuff you and the guys found outside and gave to me went into making this workshop happen. So thank you. We'll have to keep pitching in like this, too. Looks like we're facing a long journey, and useful things like ammo or equipment don't grow on trees. Plus, the further from Moscow we get, the harder they'll probably be to get. So don't forget to collect all the materials you find to keep us going. There's so many things to do. I haven't decided where I'm going to work on the suits, but I'll have to, and soon. And it's high time we fixed our uniforms. Some of our people are starting to look pretty ragged, you know? Well, Duke's plate carrier won't hold the back plate anymore, and he jokes that he's lucky it's not the front one, or else his toes would be in danger. Regardless, I am turning this little gang back into a real army. Well, that's it. I bragged enough and won't waste any more of your time. The Colonel summoned you. Well, I have stuff to do too. You guys are fast to break gear, but none to expedient to fix it. Sorry, Kathy over here. A smoke break. That's good. <laughs> oh my god. Look. This is one mean smoke. Look how gangster yeah, that thing this is. is rough. Well, <clears throat> nothing we couldn't take. Look at these papers. <laughs> okay, I'm good. Well, you are the right kind of guys. You, the Colonel, Duke, that guy did the swell job. Okay, I don't have time to listen to you, I'm sorry. Everyone talks so slowly in this game. Just like, let's go, let's go. No, except do not sit in that chair again. Invading everyone's privacy. Hey, jamming. Come on in and have a seat. Stepan's putting on a live performance here. So, Artyom, are you up for a jam? Come on, pick the guitar up. We're guitar guy at the party. <laughs> You know that guy. One of you guys is out there. Thank you, Stepan. I'm sorry to ask, Kancha, but that's just father. I'll stop it already. Our <laughs> job. Uh, the colonel's waiting for you on the bridge. <laughs> so, what's up with your plate carrier? Talkative man. 